Well, you should have brought a coat or something. I didn't know floor 55 was going to be this freaking cold. <laughs> Are you going to be okay without this? You don't feel cold if you're disappointed. If you're trying to piss me off, it's working. It's warm, though. I can't believe I'm out here all alone with this guy. This is getting weird. What's wrong, Lisbeth? Giving up already? Not on your life! And if you're gonna be a jerk about it, you might as well call me Liz. Okay, okay. Got it, Liz. Yeah, well, don't wear it out! You should get your teleport crystal ready. I know, I know, I'm doing it. And I'm handling this part on my own. Once the dragon appears, you're gonna hide under one of those crystals over there. Don't come out no matter what. Oh, come on! I'm not a noob. If I want to help you, I'll darn well- Do what I say! <laughs> Good. Okay, let's get going. Take cover! Okay! Drink one of these, just in case. Thank you, you know, for... for saving me. It's a little early to be thanking anyone. We have to find a way to get out of here first. Huh? Can't we just teleport out? Teleport Lindis! No way. Well, if we can't use crystals, that means there should be another way out. How can you be so sure there is? I mean, maybe this is some kind of trap rig to kill anyone who falls into it. Good point. Maybe it is. <laughs> Would it kill you to at least try to cheer me up? I think I have an idea. Really? Yeah. We could try running up the wall. Uh, uh, you're insane. Maybe, but that's all I got for ideas right now. Uh, no way. If I had more of a running start, I probably would have made it. Yeah, I don't think so. Kind of weird, isn't it? This wouldn't happen in real life. You know, going to strange places, meeting a total stranger, and then sleeping next to them. I mean, you actually tried running up that wall. You really are a weirdo, you know that? Well, excuse me. <laughs> Do 
Kirito, can I ask you something? Ask away. I'm all ears. Why did you risk your life like that to save me? I can't just sit back and watch someone die. I'd rather die alongside him than do nothing. Especially if that someone's a girl like you, Liz. Wow, you really are an idiot. You're the only person who'd think like that. Hey, hold my hand. Just these ones and zeros in a virtual world. I know. that special metal we came all this way for. Like you said, the dragon eats crystals, and they turn to this in its stomach. <laughs> no wonder it's hard to find. Yeah, but you found it. What's it doing down here, though? This hole isn't a trap like we thought. It's the dragon's nest. R really Uh huh. And that's not just an ingot, that's dragon excrement. You know, poop. Huh? Oh. <laughs> well... I guess this means we got what we came here for. Still stuck, though. Wait, this is supposed to be a dragon's nest, right? Yep. Because dragons are nocturnal, so it won't be long before it comes. Uh -huh. It's here! Almost there! Longsword, right? Yep. Make it awesome. <sighs> I didn't imagine it. The warmth of Kirito's hands. The way I feel. As soon as I've made the best sword I can, I'll tell him. is called Dark Repulsor. One of a kind. And it's not even in the info broker's directory. Go on, try it. Okay. Good? Bad? It's real heavy. It's a good sword. <gasps> Yay! It feels like you forged your soul into it.
Okay, you held up your end of the deal. It's time for me to pay up. So how much? Um, well, I don't really need any money. Uh. Instead, I'd like to be your exclusive blacksmith from now on. What do you mean exclusive? <sighs> What's wrong? I mean, anytime you get back from the field, stop by and let me do maintenance on your gear. Every day, from now till the end. Uh, Liz, I... Kitty Tom, I just... I... Liz! I was so worried! Asana? Liz! Where were you last night? I tried messaging you, but you didn't answer, and I couldn't track you on the map! Sorry, I kinda got stuck in a dungeon. A dungeon? You went all by yourself? Uh-uh. I went with him. Huh? Kirito? Uh, hey, Asuna. Long time no see. It's been, what, like, two days? Well, this is a surprise. I didn't know you wanted to check this place out. I wish you would have told me I could have come with you. I'm sort of confused. Do you know each other? Yeah, both of us are on the assault team, so... <laughs> he said he was looking to get a more powerful sword. So I told him about you and your shop. Oh. Why is she acting like that? I swear, if you did anything weird to her... You can try to show a little more compassion. I almost got killed. Like, that's my fault. Don't I always tell you not to fight solo? Right. I get it now. If this guy said anything rude, you'd tell me, right? Liz? If you want to talk about Rude, try this. First thing he does when he comes in is shatter my best sword. What? I'm sorry. Oh, come on. You don't have to apologize for anything. He might be a little weird, but he's not such a bad guy. Don't screw this up, Asuna. He's a keeper. <laughs> but I told you, it's not... I'll be right back. But you're going to leave the store? Hold down the fort for me. Later! What? No, wait! Liz! Uh -huh. I almost got away with it. A couple more minutes, and I would have gone back to my usual cheerful self. Liz, I... How'd you know I was here? I scanned the whole town for you from up there. Figures you'd do something crazy like that. Sorry if I worried you. I'm fine now. Must be all the excitement. I'm not used to having adventures. Anyway... I'll just forget everything I said. Okay? <laughs> Liz, I... I just wanted to thank you. See, I... I don't know. I always thought dying was better than surviving day after day. Living with the guild. Kirito. But then, we got stuck in that hole, and I was really happy we were still alive. I realized that even here, our lives are real and have meaning. Thank you for helping me see that, Liz. I guess it's what I've been looking for this whole time. Yeah, me too. I know what you mean. I was also looking for something. Something real. Hoping I'd find it. The warmth of your hand. For me. That was real. Oh my god. Do me a favor, okay? Tell Asuna what you told me. <laughs> 